What is this? Where am I? Look at all that water. There is no land in sight. Who are you? Don't hurt me. Answer my question. Who are you? I don't know. I just got here. You don't know your own name? No. I'm sorry. Am I supposed to have a name? What are you doing? Your hand. It's just like mine. You are a creature just like me. I thought I was the only one. Oh. Yes. Well, not exactly. I know. You're bone of my bone, flesh of my flesh. I beg your pardon. The Creator. Last night the Creator put me to sleep and took out some bone and flesh. He created you from bone of my bone and flesh of my flesh. So, you've been here for a while. Yes. The Creator created me out of the elements. Then he created you from bone of my bone and flesh of my flesh. This creator? He looks like us too. No. He is spirit. He has no looks. He took on an appearance like me, in order to talk to me. He built this thing that floats on endless water. Yes. It's called a boat. He built the boat and he created us to steer the boat. Steer the boat? We can make the boat go in any direction. Did the Creator tell us where he wants us to go with the boat? Yes. He gave us this owner's manual to tell us where he wants us to go. But this is endless water. What difference does it make where we go? It's not endless. There are land masses and fishing grounds and harbors. Based on the instructions from the Creator, I've set a course for a fishing ground. Fishing ground? A place to go to get something to eat. The fish are what we eat. Oh, I understand that. I'm hungry. How do we get the fish to eat once we get to the fishing ground? The creator gave us instructions in the owner's manual. Everything is in here that we need to survive. Including how to get the fish out of the water. Oh, so the fish are in the water. Yes. Why do we have to wait until we get to the fishing ground? Why can't we get the fish out of the water now? Because the owner's manual tells us where to get fish and where not to get fish. But if the fish are in the water, there must be some fish around us. Why don't we stop the boat and get the fish? The owner's manual tells us to go to the fishing ground before we try to get the fish. But why wait? I'm hungry. Let's get the fish now. I really don't know why we have to wait until we get to the fishing ground. But the Creator knows. And His message to us says we must do things His way. And His way says we wait until we get to the fishing ground. This is ridiculous. The fish are in the water. We have water all around us. Why can't we stop the boat and get the fish? Because the owner's manual tells us not to. I'm sure the Creator knows a lot more about the fish he created than you do. So, when the Creator wrote down that we should wait until we get to the fishing ground, he has a good reason. Let me see the owner's manual. I want to see the reason. The Creator doesn't always give the reason for all of his instructions. If he did, the owner's manual would be too big to carry. He doesn't give a reason. So, I think we should stop and get the fish. I think we should trust the creator and follow the instructions in the owner's manual. Why should I trust the creator when he didn't give us a reason? Well, he was smart enough to create me out of the elements and... He was smart enough to create you from bone of my bone and flesh of my flesh. I think he's proved himself to be smart enough that we can trust him. Well, I don't. I'm hungry. And I don't trust him at all. I'm going to stop the boat and get some fish.
on second thought, maybe she's not bone of my bone and flesh of my flesh. Based on a play by Bob Snook. Conditions for use, do not sell any part of this script, even if you rewrite it. Pay no royalties, even if you make money from performances. You may reproduce and distribute this script freely, but all copies must contain this copyright statement.